what did you think and you know given as as uh, you know mr sinha was mentioning these uncertain times we live in globally uh, how does this budget place us and does it place us on that road to 6.57% economic growth or do we still need to kind of watch how that goes over the next few months i agree overall with what janme said and i would just add one more word saying that it was a very balanced budget so it balanced growth with fiscal prudence and that is something that we were hoping to see the significant investment in uh, uh, infrastructure so the public uh, capex spend the 33% increase is welcome bill should be a big boost to economic growth but look at it along with that the additional uh, support one more year to states for improving urban infrastructure creating the right environment for municipal bonds so that this is not just a one year exercise this is something that is then ongoing towards your query that the 6 and a half 6% 7% growth will we see it uh, coming on very much uh, this should support that as we are starting to see growth coming uh, it's it's not that growth comes only to large companies it comes to companies of all sizes and the additional 2 lakh crore credit guarantee scheme to msmes again very welcome so they have thought through various aspects of what needed to be done another ask of cii was to help those at the lower income segment and the rationalizing of uh, income tax and over there again yes again a welcome move and finally i would say to encourage manufacturing in india um a number of initiatives have been suggested just correcting the inverse customs duty structure where relevant cutting customs duty where uh, relevant on parts on uh, raw materials on inputs all of these go towards creating a robust foundation for growth not only for the coming year but for coming years ahead right uh, 